In this video we'll briefly discuss, almost all you need to know about bisoprolol. How it works, what it's used for, contraindications, adverse effects, precautions and some advice to patients receiving it. Bisoprolol belongs to a category of drugs, called beta blockers. It works mainly by blocking beta-1 receptors in the heart, leading to decreased heart rate and force of contraction, and delaying impulse conduction. Bisoprolol is known commercially as Concor, Bisoprolol, Zebeta, and there are many other trade names, so use the drug index of your country to know all of them. It is available as tablets in concentrations of 1.25, 2.5, 5 and 10 mg. It is used for the treatment of hypertension, chronic stable angina pectoris, and for chronic stable heart failure. It is contraindicated in patients with asthma, chronic obstructive bronchopneumonia, acute heart failure, severe hypotension, bradycardia, less than 50 beats per minute, atrioventricular heart blocks, Raynaud syndrome. As it may cause, bradycardia, hypotension, worsening of heart failure, so dose may need to be reduced. Bronchospasm in patients with an obstructive respiratory disease. Hypoglycemia, so it should be administered with caution to patients with diabetes. Gastrointestinal disturbances, headache, fatigue, muscle weakness. Dose should be reduced in patients with renal or hepatic impairment, maximum 10 mg per day. Avoid or monitor combination with, methloquine, digoxin, amiodrone, diltiazem, verapamil, because of risk of bradycardia. Tricyclic antidepressants, antipsychotics, antihypertensive drugs, because of risk of hypotension. And finally some advice to patients receiving it. Don't suddenly stop the drug, it should be tapered slowly before stopping, to prevent rebound symptoms and adverse effects. So contact your physician if you want to stop the drug for any reason. If your pulse is less than 50 beats per minute, contact your physician before taking the drug. If you are a diabetic patient, you should monitor your blood glucose level closely. Report the following symptoms to your physician, dizziness, decreased pulse, shortness of breath, confusion, rash or any unusual bleeding. The drug may cause drowsiness, so use it with caution while driving or performing other tasks requiring mental alertness. Don't take OTC medications, including diet aids, cold or nasal preparations, alpha-adrenergic stimulants, without consulting physician. That's all for this video. Subscribe to get more drug information.